shit. It's time. Uh. Uh. It's the hunting champion, 84. <laughs> With a big old bounty, bro. That's just box number one. Then there's box number two. Then there's the long box. The picture in the thumbnail is the actual picture of uh, all the books. I don't think I'm going to be able to get through them all today. That's why I put part one, because it's going to take a minute. Let's go to this chat. JP NYC Biggie Shack Come on, let's scroll down. There we go. Unruly Simeon Um Louis Ramirez, 504 boy, take the snake. YouTube is 90, 36 chambers. Zach Beasy, Mastodon, Superior. Mm. Um, yeah. Yo, hot tags. Hot tags are welcome. 36, you want a hot tag? That's cool. Biggie, you want a hot tag? TMC. Hopefully they don't copy like this shit. Like they did last time. Yeah, Biggie's thing. 36. Chambers. Boom. Link sent. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Dun, you suck. <laughs> you suck. <laughs> On that song. Bang. Okay. Uh, yeah, TMC, what up? Superior Funk. Um, yeah, I sent out the hot tags to 36 and Biggie. Boom. Yo, Chaos, what up, dude? I'm just going to get right into it. I got, um, I got a big-ass comic call, dude. And, uh, yeah, I'm gonna go through it. I just, I don't know. I just couldn't. Uh, I couldn't turn down the deal, even though I got C2E2, the Comic Con coming up Friday. I'm supposed to be. I, sh you know, I could have went much harder than I did. Um, but yeah, I ended up leaving with like three boxes of comics, and it's all the stuff that's right up my wheelhouse, man. Bronze, silver, stuff like that. You know, so I'm like. Come on, man. I did a, a JB. I said, come on, man. You know I'm going to walk away with this. Captain Comics. What's up, man? And if you guys haven't, Hialeah Comic Bro put me on to a fantastic TV show. That Hunter's show on Amazon Prime. Uh, shout out to Hialeah for putting me on to that because I watched a couple episodes. I just finished episode two. You should watch that show. If you got Amazon Prime, watch Hunters. There's a lot of comic book influence in it. Uh, like Orion and the New Gods comics come up a bit. Yeah, but there's like a comic book vibe. Uh, there's a Tarantino-esque vibe, if I may say. It's cool. Hunting down Nazis in the 1970s is the premise. And, uh, you know, Al Pacino's in it. So. Um, Chris Barrett, what up? 
<laughs> Yo, 36. Look at that. He said, Kenny, send again. You sent me a link to the Hunter's trailer. Oh, that's so funny because I sent someone that link earlier. That's what's crazy about Apple is because I got a Mac laptop and an iPhone. So if I copy and paste the link on my phone, when I hit paste on my computer, it will paste the same link that I copied on my phone device. Does that make sense? Looks weird. Okay, now I sent you the actual link. Metarog, hello. Spidey fan. What's up, man? Did I miss anybody? I don't think so. I'm just going to start showing books till the boys get in. So I'm just going to go through uh, box number one. There's a good amount of like runs, like little consecutive chunks of issues. You know? Um, here is... Ow, oh, my eye. Ah, oh, sorry about that. We had technical difficulties with my eyeball. Hold on. We'll be right back. I gotta scratch my eye. Okay, I'm good now. Uh, let's start with some defenders. We got defenders number nine of four. There's a in another box, there's like an older run of Defenders, but in this box is this little chunk. Bang. <laughs> what up, James? Those are true words, brother. So we got number 94. I think 36. I'm going to I'm gonna wait till 36 gives me the thumbs up backstage, and I'll bring him in, but he's waiting in the wings. You know what? Let me just grab a chunk of these. So yeah, man. We got number 94, 105, cold as crystal. You're as cold as crystal, willing to sacrifice. 36. What's up? What up, man? Not much, man. Chill. Oh, yeah, I can hear you just fine. <laughs> nice. You, you had some, a little holly of your own. Yeah, right? I got some books today too. Oh, and, a, and I got a book from CGC. I'm not real happy about it, but oh no. Yeah, I think because I, I used uh, CCS, and I think they messed my book up. Really? You think it went back more to where? Yeah, it. Uh, there's scratches on it that weren't there when I sent it. Sent it. Interesting. Mm -hmm. Interesting. Yeah. Huh. Let me show this uh, couple books here, then we'll pop over yeah. to some stuff that you got. Go ahead. I'm going to do one of these. <laughs> um, yeah, man, I went to you know my dude's house, and he was like, I realized I could probably get a better deal if I was just like, how much for just the box, man, instead of me like going through particular. <laughs> right. I'm like, you want to sell that box to me? And he yeah. was like, yeah. So then we started talking like, box prices and i was like okay this is cool yeah um and it worked out pretty nice let's bring the immortal biggie shack in into the squid oh, yes. mm. wow look at this guy we got defenders 108 with this crazy looking blue beast with the tentacles coming out of his side that's an ill one What's up, big? What up, bro? What are you doing, big 36? That's a pretty cool one. I like that. Yo, Big E. What's up, man? Chilling, man. Just watching you with your mountain of fuck. You couldn't find any room in them fucking three boxes of stuff that stack on top end, dude. Just let me know, bro. I got to know that. I can't hear <laughs> big. Dude, that room is getting pretty full, man. I can't hear big. <laughs> They were really full. 
You can't hear Biggie on your end Thursdays? Nah, nope. Oh, that's weird. I mean, that, that's happened. It's been a while since that's happened, but. Uh, yeah, I'll back out and come back. Okay, yeah, I think once you, you leave and come back a few times, it stop, kind of stops happening. Yeah, let's try that. We got some Defenders 121. To down. Yeah, man. And Defenders See, you about a Three. You know, I think. I think I'm glad you did it this way because you're not going to find Bobby Book deals with that fucking con, bro. No, I'm really not. He, it's funny because he said that <laughs> he said that himself because, uh, you know, I was telling him about how, yeah, I'm going to the con. He was like, and he said the same thing. He's like, you ain't going to find these prices at no con. Uh, and I was like, no, that's that's true. But the that's why, like, me going to that con, I might come back with something, but uh, with some things. But it's more for like I don't know the hang. I need a little getaway, so I'm okay. sure you'll get a nice, cool, big old key slab, brudabra do, you know, something. Yeah, but yeah. Probably, but I'm not gonna go there to like dig through boxes and come back with a bunch of books. I'm, you know, I might try to pick up one big book, try to get as good a deal as I can. Put the other dealers against each other, you know. So like, see what this one guy. Oh, you gonna make a competition? Pretty much because I'll go. Cause I did it at the last one where like, like when I was hunting that Craven book, a few people had it and I would go to one dealer, find it and be like, how oh, much I see. For it? Then I go to the other guy and be like, yo, he's selling it for, and I, and I would lie sometimes too and say that he's selling it for cheaper than he was. But like, yo, he's doing it for that. That's smart. Yeah. Like, I thought you meant that you were going to compete with the guys that went with you. Like you got this book. <laughs> I got that. I'm sorry. Oh no. With, bro, with Don Gata on the scene, it's not even worth it. <laughs> <laughs> What's up, big? Can you hear me better now, bro? Yeah, man, I got you loud and clear. Oh, yeah. good. I'm good, man. I'm doing good, bro. My fucked up sleep patterns. <laughs> yeah. Let's go through some of these. On the the beginning of this box is stuff that's not a lot of like long runs, but it gets into that more later. Uh, Miss Marvel number four. Nice. Oh yeah. Miss Marvel number five. Sweet. Nice. Marvel Spotlight on the man named Moon Knight. Number nice. 29. I think 28. Bro, is did y'all see Aficionado's video, his last one? No, I haven't yet. Uh, I posted one, though. Yeah. Bro, just some dope old DC 10 cent, 12 cent silver. Yeah, he's got, he's got a lot of books. books. Jesus. He's got a lot of books, that dude. He's got double to that. We got this issue of Moon Knight. Moon Knight's another one that has great covers. This one is the first time Moon Knight and Spidey meet. Pretty cool. Then we got a little run of Marvel team ups. Hey, that looks kind of early. What number is that? Is that fucking one? Seven. What number is that? Seven. Seven? They don't look like one. <laughs> yeah, Spidey and Thor. Any giant size defenders? You know what? It's fun. I think there is actually. I think there is. I haven't really put things in good order yet. Marvel Team of 26. Torch and Thor. I'm a 55. Nice. Spider Man and Warlock. This one is like. There's like a little something a little special about it. It's the first appearance of one of the Infinity Stones, the Time Stone, whatever. But. Spidey and Thor again, number 70. Number 77, Spidey and Miss Marvel. Spider Woman, number two. Marvel Triple Action, numero uno. Those are cool. Giant size Marvel Triple Action. Oh yeah, sweet. Man, he says Great Hall. Still waiting though. <laughs> I'm, I'm kind of a, I'm like they say, I'm burying the lead a little bit here. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm not showing you the straight. Every fire fucking, ball. every other, every time I see ninety in a chat, he's telling people give him books. It don't matter if it's fucking who was it. He's telling Perry give him books. Yeah, he says he's Perry telling. <laughs> 
He said somebody else. I was like, God damn it, 90. Uh, let's see. Maybe I'm not going to show you every little thing, but that's a cool Ooh. rider, 15. Nice. And this one, I don't even know about this one. Marvel Chillers. Modred the Mystic, number one. Never seen Damn. that. Damn. Look at that. Yeah. Modred. Yeah, Modred. Marvel Chillers. It's Holy cool. shit. Metarog probably knows about these. This is like, I always think of these kind of books as in Metarog's lane. This era. Uh, what's a good highlight? Just fucking with you, 90. Demon Bear. Ah, hey, cool demon there. That's the one people like, and then you know a bunch of new mutants. Um, I'll show you some of these, and then some Deathlock, Nomad number one. Some champions, champions number four. What's behind it? X Men. I want a fucking first Marauders. Ooh. What is that? A little reprint of yeah, X Men okay. One. Nice. Ooh, yeah, that's pretty sick. Yeah, that's a fun one. Look at this one. I don't I know. I love if them fucking reprints. Can you? Oh see shit! It? Yeah. Right. It's what's her name? Spider Mite. Spider Ling. Oh, I don't know her name. That's pretty cool. Got an FF1 facsimile. Oh, I fucking love those Marvel. I, I still ain't got my hands on one of them fucking things yet, dude. Yeah, it's so clean, man. I love the facsimiles, dude. They look yeah. so nice. Yep. Oh, that's the facsimile. I thought it was a lenticular. Okay. Here's another little. I don't I don't know if I have that one. So what? Re yeah. Re those are hard to get, bro. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. That one and uh, number four, like fucking $10, oh. twenty dollar books. Dang, that ain't no reprint. There you go. Damn. No, that ain't that's one. That's FF fifty seven right there, playa. Now, now we're cooking with gas. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Here. Yeah, when we get towards the back, yeah. Oh, we gonna spice it up <laughs> a little bit. Boom. Bang, a little FF. Boom. A little bubble cover. Okay. <laughs> And then uh -oh. this chunk at the end is why I bought this particular box. This is the last of this short box. And when I saw all these in that box, I was like, oh, yeah, I'll take this one. Especially for the price. <laughs> <laughs> Could not be that price. Shout out to Billy Books for tagging on the whole long box, though, bro. What a hustler old Bobby is. Yeah. So... Let's run through some Doctor Strange if we if we can here. So, what number does Doctor Strange start off? Maybe someone in the chat can tell me, because he's like one of those guys like Hulk, where you know Hulk yeah. one hundred two is a takes over from Tales to Astonish, and Doctor Strange. I think is uh, the same thing. Didn't he start in Strange Tales? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. So like, there isn't like a Doctor Strange. You know, ninety-seven. Oh, right. there's not a number one, huh? Yeah, right. Not in this run. Fuck, I wouldn't know, bro. I know that there is a, uh, there is one that's considered his first silver, but oh, I think it's that? a strange tale. Fantastic. Tales. So everyone's saying one sixty-nine. So this is because one sixty-nine oh. one that everyone people chase that as like a key book. So I got it right from there. This is one seventy, dude. This is right uh, in the beginning. Oh. oh, that's cool. I didn't Damn. Even that. So 170, 171. I can't lie. I don't know much about Doctor Strange. No, nah, me neither. That? Okay. You had some dope covers back then. Yeah. Bro. 173. I like that one. Mm -hmm. I just found out. I was I sent Unruly Simeon the, the little uh, something on IG that there's a Pink Floyd album cover that the artist for the who designed the album cover 
use like a panel from a Doctor Strange comic in it, and it's in it's one of the Pink Floyd albums. It's pretty dope. That's cool. Yeah, Doctor Strange is like in the corner, the Living Tribunal's up at the top, but they it's like faded in the background, so it's like you barely notice it unless you really look. All right, Strange Tales 110 is his first appearance, and Doctor Strange 169 is the first. Yeah. Album. There you go. Right after. Here's 170. Um, so I was right about the first appearance. Black Knight. Strange Tales. This is yeah. I heard about this era where Doctor Strange rocked like a mask. <laughs> yeah. 179. Oh, Spidey in it. 181. So, 183. Look at that era, Doctor Strange. What a costume, huh? Yeah. That mask. Boom. And then I think this run must have ended. If if the chat could also help me out with this one, when did this? When did Volume One end? And Volume Two begin? Because now I have Volume Two. Doctor Strange starts here. This is number five. Mm. Mm. Number seven. Yeah, Moon Guy knows the deal. Yeah, Saucer Full of Secrets. That's the that's the Pink Floyd album. Mm. Yes, that's right, Chris Barrett. Chris Barrett sent me that Doctor Strange with Spidey on it in my Barrett. Hey, okay. Yeah, he did. Then we're going to rock over to number Ocho, number eight. Number 12. Look at that one. That's so fire. Wow. Number 13. Kind of looks like the Thanos ship when he was a scarecrow. And if anyone in the chat knows any Doctor Strange keys, I really don't. And I didn't like put it through the key collector app thing yeah so i don't know i just knew it was a great deal but i haven't i haven't done any key research yet so if you see one you give it a shout uh number 20 dr strange number 20 23 24 yo highly a comic bro bro so I think I watched that Hunter's shit before. They hunt toys a lot. It's brand new. Oh, no, no, no. It's yeah, a no. scripted show. Yeah, it's good. I watched oh, the first fuck. couple episodes. How much have you seen? Like two episodes. Mm, me too. That's exactly how much yeah. I've seen. And it sucked me in. I was like, oh, I got to stop or I'm going to sit here for hours and watch it. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> 27. Bang. 20, dude, like I said, this is like a straight up run right now. 29, Doctor Strange. 30. 35. Yes, Hylia. I, that was one of the first things I said on the stream. I was like, shout out to Hylia for putting me onto a fire TV show, Hunters, dude. Because I watched the first two episodes and I'm hooked. Yeah. <laughs> Lucha cracks me up, bro. He messages me all the time, man. Yeah, I mean, man. Fifty four. We got a couple more. Fifty seven. Seventy three. And uh, the king size annual of Doctor Strange. Nice. Yeah. Yeah. I think I like that one the most. <laughs> so we stacked, man. We stacked. Oh, no, that's second fucking. That must be some early Doctor Strange that fucking, what was it, 170 or some shit? Yeah, bro. Oh, it is. It's probably yeah. like the third appearance or something. Yeah. Uh, well, no, in Strange Tales. He has like a big run in Strange Tales. But oh, okay. As far as once he gets his own solo series, yeah, that's yeah. The that. Oh, how did I not show you this? Hold up. Invaders. Look at that, invaders. Right? Nice. Look at this one. Oh. 
That's hey, that's, really that's cool. my shit. I like invaders way more than defenders. There just ain't enough of it. Yeah. So, oh, look at this. I didn't show you this one. Look at this. Where is it? Invaders right. is fucking dub. I just saw a glimpse of a funny one. Here we go. Yeah. <laughs> Little Layfield, dude. I'm tempted to get those every now and then. That Layfield cap. <laughs> Number one. I'm paying five dollars for the fucking thing, though, bro. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Never What's seen say about this? I'll say that it looks crazy, obviously, right? But I kind of dig the uh, that this that eagle he put on his forehead instead of the A, because the yeah. A is kind of silly, bro. To have a big yeah. A on your forehead. Yeah. I can dig that. Bro, I've always enjoyed Layfield's body structure, frame, muscling. The guy's a fucking genius, bro. I don't give a fuck what anybody says, bro. Mm. He could draw a muscle on a turd, and it would look right to me, bro. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. I don't know. I'm just saying. I'm just saying, bro. I'm a I fan. Know. Yeah, like, I, I'm a, I was a huge fan. I think his personality killed his... Uh, his personality is trash, Man, but Kirby did a lot of muscular frame, like he body style, style type shit. I like that kind of shit. Yeah, his yeah. art's weak as fuck, if you ask me. I ain't saying fucking Kirby's just, Layfield. I'm just saying the muscle shit. Like, I'm just, oh, you heard it here first. Biggie thinks Layfield is as good as Kirby. <laughs> we just, Breaking uh, news. Yeah, Breaking I, I would news. be fucking ran off. Ran off with brooms. I got it here, Biggie. You dumbass <laughs> late <Layfield> shit. <laughs> These guys, he draws, have such skinny legs. That's a problem. They don't match. He really that. couldn't fucking figure out like how far away a leg was from <laughs> being in front. All that <laughs> compensation and all that. He can. He never did get that right, bro. Yeah. No. He either drew. He either drew really big feet or really small feet. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, exactly. <laughs> but I liked everything else, dude. Like bad, bad, bad rock, or where the fuck his name was. That big round motherfucker, bro. It was like, god damn, dude, that's a beast. You know what I'm saying? And yeah. profit, all the motherfuckers were swole, dude. You're talking cock swole shit back in the day, bro. You don't see that they shit no more. Prime weird thing with the faces, and they all oh, yeah. have that little of. thin nose. It's like a very yeah. Yeah. Like I was a huge fan of his, of New Mutants, but they all do look the same. Yeah. Yeah, there's actually I think I uh if I'm not mistaken, I, <laughs> I actually skipped over it. Uh, <laughs> oh wait, no, this ain't this isn't another box. Because there's new mutants in there, but yeah, the older it's ones. Not his era. Yeah. But in another box there's his era of new mutants. Oh no! Oh, hold up. oh, I didn't even know that was in there. Look at that. Ah, oh, second print, nice. What? Yeah. Damn, I want that. Second print, first cable. That's a cool one. I never got one of those. It's fucking nice. Yeah, I'm not mad at that. I need that first print though. That's a pretty cool one. Yeah, I got that hanging yeah. on the wall. First oh, print's gonna cost you. Yeah. Oh, and then. Uh, I got a bunch oh. of Secret Wars 2. Nice. Nice. I know Secret War 1 is where it's at, but... They were good. Yeah, all right. So, you know, I, I starting you guys with light work. So that was the light box. Um, but 36, want to kick... I'm curious what yeah. you got. All right. It's just a couple. It's not... I don't got boxes. It was just a few. <laughs> nah, yeah, I know. <laughs> <laughs> they had this little con... Uh, in Jersey today, so I took a ride over there and see if I could find anything decent. I got a couple, couple keys. I got uh, this one here for a screen. Oh yeah, yeah, nice. Uh, yeah, and then I got this one. First Firestar. Hey. Oh yeah, the Amazing Friends number one. Uh, I like that book. Yeah. And then this one, Shit. dude. I when I saw this and the condition it was in, I was like, "Yo, bang!" Oh shit, yes, dude. This thing is pretty. I mean, there's some spine ticks over here or over here. Sorry, let me do this. Like here, wow. you could see them, but 
I mean, that's dude, a the cop cover, classic. Yeah, dude. The laughing fish. The first time they used the laughing fish. Right? Yes, yeah, it is, dude. This thing, it was. I was like, oh my god, I got. I had to have it. Oh man. Yeah, that's. They're the three, and then I had Ooh. a pack. I had a package waiting when I got home, and. Bam! Oh, shit. whoa, son! First Hellboy. Yeah, but the grade, I'm not too. I wasn't too happy with because. Let me see if I can get this going right. I don't know if you could see these scratches, I right? Can. Yeah, I, yeah. They what the fuck? They, they were not on the book when I sent it. Now I sent it to CCS to get pressed, and that's the reason why I got the. 8.5 because I got the graders note. What so, the fuck? yeah, I was a little annoyed about that, but damn, still a cool book, man. Yeah, no, but the uh, I, mean, Hialeah, a I learned from Hialeah actually that what's specifically a key about that first in color, in color, yes, Hellboy. Remember that was on the quiz show that we did, yeah, and I didn't. I wasn't sure, but yeah. that ugh, that doesn't sound good, man. If that shit got crashed, bro. Yeah, dude. I was like, what the hell? Uh, do you have any photos of that book before you? No, started? I didn't. That's of course I was not. like, God I was, you know, I, was I, was I jumped right in and I was like, sending stuff right away. I had they've had that for like four months, I think. <laughs> so. Yeah. Damn. Sometimes, dude, I, I'll uh, I'll look at books and and see like fucking shit wrong with them, and there'll be books I took pictures of on Instagram, and I'll right. be able to look back and see yeah. that the damage was there already. I, I've even asked eighty four a couple of times, I'm like, dude, does this look like it's fucked up right. in this picture? And he'll be like, yeah, I see it because right. I, I hate the thought of fucking books up. You know what <laughs> I mean? Right. But yeah, dude, that's there's scratches because they're clearly visible. Like I would have noticed them when I was looking at the book before I sent it in, you know, because if it was going to be looks this, this, this low of a grade, I wouldn't have sent it. You know what I mean? So, yeah, I was bummed. Dang. That's it is. Jesus it is, it is. You I've almost only... got to want to fucking damage the book when, when it's that bad, too, is what <laughs> yeah. I think. Uh, yeah, like. That's why I hear from people that press books, like, you almost have to want to fuck the book up to damage it. Yeah, I just don't think they're real careful. That's yeah. the problem. I think getting it pressed elsewhere and then just have them grade it's probably the way to go. Yes, yeah, so, and that's I have a I'm having DS do a couple things for me, so I know they'll come back primo. Yeah, yeah, he does a great job. I've yeah, seen, like this my Submariner that came back purple. That was one CCS did it. Uh, the first Rocket Raccoon that I got back recently, and I got one that. Is still at CCS right now. That Savage Tales first man thing. Right. I got back. That's fucking dope. But dude, JD I was, got that recently. I was in love with this book. Oh, bro. dude, I've I've come close it's, to buying that a few times. It's so bright and vibrant. I was like, oh my god, dude. I've like, never seen it, bro. I don't think I've ever seen it. That's dude, crazy. It's so pretty. Yep. That's I a classic like, bat book. Man. I can, yes. I can tell it's nostalgic. I just don't remember seeing it before. Yeah, this fish gun. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I love that gimmick, dude. Yeah, shout the chat a little bit. Jay Hood, he just recently did a stream. I was watching some of that. He had some good stuff, but he had technical difficulty. He said, "Hey, everyone, peeking in during bath time." No, I'm not bad. <laughs> I was wondering, dude. Yeah, Ben Compton, Compton, <laughs> in the house. Carter Lee, all and naked and bubbly, everybody. <laughs> Oh, Damn! Yes, yeah. sucks. That's the last time I'll use them. Yeah, shit. Mark the Cuddy Sark. Thanks, man. He's like in the trio. And NYC said, you know, even if they don't do anything about it, he says maybe you should still say some just to put right. it on notice. Yeah. Definitely. <laughs> yeah. So next time, if you ever dare to do it, they really fuck your shit. No. <laughs> 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 they log your name in there. <laughs> yeah, they're like, oh, it's that guy that bitched about his fucking cover. It's that 36 guy. Yeah, man. Right. <laughs> Here's you your get fucking it 2.1. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let me show you another 
All so, right. And, You're going to bring Bro, it I, hold on. Hold on. I just thought of something that's mind-blowing, bro. Can I please take a fucking millisecond? Bro, these bro. motherfuckers that buy shit off of eBay that know that the book is not listed as the way it is and then get it and bitch about it and, oh, wow. and, and get their money back and keep the book and yeah. still have a fucking problem are disgusting nasty fucking people bro yeah man. that's how i fucking feel dude we're tired of what's it what's the bro. scenario again people that do what people are saying they're looking for high grade shit yeah and then they they look at a book with pictures in it that's yep. probably they, they could tell is not fucking what it's listed as like it's not a 9.0 it's not a whatchamacallit they get the book if you're going to bitch all right you at least have to send the, mo the book back if you're keeping yeah. the book and the money i don't want to hear you complain that's yeah. all i'm saying right oh so they win they win the claim to get their money back yeah they, oh, win the, they keep the book they and the money. i don't want do. i don't hear a sob story you won twice bro yeah. that's how i feel yeah you know what happens because i sell some, me, bro. i sell pops on ebay i don't sell books i sell a lot of pops and um they automatically win once they put in they want to return and then it's up to the seller to send them the return label so a lot of times you know, guys don't even care, and they, they get that's they just get to keep the book and get the money back. Wow. It, you know, eBay's rough with that stuff on sellers, man. There's a lot of work a seller has to do, yeah, to to really get their stuff back. Like I had a guy, I saw um, uh, what's his name, Bruce Willis's character from Pulp Fiction. Uh, oh yeah, Butch. Yeah. yeah. It was a uh, it was yeah. a pop. I know that Travolta Julius because I'm Julius, yeah. but go ahead. It was a it was the pop of Butch from Pulp Fiction. And there must have been like a little dent on the box. And I just said it was new. I didn't say the box like usually people like question like is the box near mint? Like is it any damage to it? Like I just said it was new. Like I didn't say the box. I didn't even notice it, honestly. Um, well, this guy he like pff, blew me up. He yeah. was like, Yo, this is not near mint box. Blah, blah blah. I'm like, Hold up, bro. I said, First of all, I, sh I had pictures on there. Yeah, if you got I, pictures, you know, like you never asked any details about anything. Like, all right, this is what I'm gonna do rather than fight with this guy and send him a, a shipping slip to send the, the pop back to me. I said, I'll just split the money with you and keep it. I don't even want to deal with it. Yeah. Because then it would have cost me money to send it out. And then eBay is yeah. going to take the money, you know, the fee anyway. Mm -hmm. that, you know, it's it's yeah. just this whole big process. Yeah. As a the ideal scenario is if you guys can, if, if you can make a case that it got fucked up during shipping. Right. And you both get your money. You would keep right. your money and that person would get a refund and keep his shit. Right, you can make the claim that like, yo, look, U.S. the delivery guy, <laughs> right? Yeah, you know that's nice. But. Right, no, nah, he was he wasn't. No, I'm very sorry, man. I didn't mean to get <laughs> a shit storm started. <laughs> yeah, no, it's all right. Fuck those guys, oh, though. Man. Yeah, he's the next <laughs> a shit ton of books. So he is, and all right, I'm gonna some, maybe the most fire. I'm just gonna jump right to it. Maybe the most fire chunk. Oh shit! All right, but this still. Oh my god, there's so much. Everybody, get ready. It's one of my favorites, though. Uh, oh, let me just show you these off top. He's, he's loading the cannon. Because I don't know if this is. This is the one from. Cool little just Black Widow. You know, it's kind of mm -hmm. relevant with the movie, the, the blonde haired chick. And then Decent. this is the variant. For that. So whatever, those are fun. Um. You know, we got a little 266. We'll first gambit for that ass. What? Nice. You know, that book ain't. You no got fire. another one. God damn it, bro. Yeah. I yeah. know. <laughs> it is. This uh, is like your fourth one, ain't it? Uh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's my third. I, it is my fourth one, but I sold one, so this is my. It's the third one I own. Yeah. Nice. Boom. Damn. Now let's get into. This is a run right here. Okay. Uh oh. Let me start with bum, bum. The, the high numbers and work my way down. We're going to see how low will it go. Bum, bum, bum. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so we got a nice 
Silver Age <laughs> Metarog. He says, looks familiar. <laughs> because reminder, Metarog celebration on the 24th. That's tomorrow, folks. One lucky viewer who's there supporting Metarog is going to win this book from Metarog in his. Nice. Not that one, but one <laughs> like it. That's right. Similar, but not the Similar. same. Similar. Yes. <laughs> I'll be giving away some too, just a little Marvel, still sealed Marvel three pack. That's around here somewhere. Um, all right, let's run through. So we have a nice Silver Age run of oh. Daredevil. That's hey, yeah. run. That's, that was number one thirty seven. But let's start with the low numbers, the Silver Ages. We got number forty nine. Ooh, yeah. Nice. Boom. We got number 42. Wow. The Jester. First appearance of the Jester, if anyone cares. ta -da. Then we got number... Ooh, look how cool that is. <laughs> That's some Gene Colin fire right there. Number 41. Yes. Death of Matt Murdock. Wow. Boom. What up, uh, Dollar Bin? Fodder. Oh, unruly Arctic. Arctic white pages. What up, Dollar Bin? Fodder. Long box diving. If I didn't shout you out, Carolina. Chris. I don't know if I shouted you out before. Um, let's keep on going down the Daredevil train. Oh, baby. Damn. Doom cover. Little Doom. Yeah, Living Prison. 38. Nice. And, you know, as far as conditions go, you know, it's not like they're definitely not beat copies. They're not mint or anything, but they're not beat. I haven't, to be honest, I haven't opened up the plastic to really go through them, so I, I don't know. But <laughs> what I can see, they're, they're not, like, jacked. Because for the price that he's that I did them for, it didn't matter if the covers were fucking detached. <laughs> Still worth it. <laughs> <laughs> right, you just 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 covers. You're good. I didn't want to. I didn't want to press the issue. I'm like, you'll do it for that much. I'm like, all right. So I'll, I'll just right. take, take my money. Yeah, don't ask any questions. All right, we you change your mind. Uh, so there's number thirty six. The name of the game is mayhem. Uh, what's up, Javi? Good to see you. Uh, now we got number thirty four. Ooh. The squash and beetle. Some beetle. I, I noticed you're not going in the higher direction. You're going in the lower, so that's kind of interesting. <laughs> yeah. yeah we're gonna see how low will this run go? Does it go to number one? Do I have a number one? Oh. They're going to have to see. <laughs> Stay tuned. <laughs> <to> find <laughs> out. Yeah. Anything under is, 20 is pretty good. Are we going to go to number one? <laughs> You'll find out after these words. <laughs> <laughs> uh. <laughs> <laughs> we got number 33 some more beetle beef behold the beetle are these in a row yeah 33 and 34 a little pair of beetle issues so that we got 36 34 so it's 35 a key maybe number Shit. Number 31. Ooh, bro, that shit is fresh. Hell yeah. Yeah, dude. There's been a lot, him, bro. There's a lot yeah. of artists that have that got down on this early Daredevil. Like Gene Colan, I know, is a big one. Wally Wood, I think his name is. Wally Wood. Whoa. Kirby did a couple issues. Wow. There's, there's a Kirby. I wonder here. who did that one. Yeah, I think this is. Wally Wood. That's pretty fly. I think uh I think Ditko even did some, right? I think Daredevil had like all kind of he didn't have like one steady guy in the early going. <clears throat> oh yeah, I think this is Kirby right here. Maybe I'm wrong, I don't know. Number twenty nine. Oh, I had that. I, yeah. No, that's not Kirby, I don't think. That's uh I think that's Gene someone Cole. else, but Maybe Gene Cole. Probably. Yeah. 
I sent. I gave that one a discovery. Oh yeah, nice. Yeah, it's pretty nice too. I definitely know the Kirby one when I see it. It might be. I could be wrong, but number twenty-eight. Thou shall not covet thy neighbor's planet. <laughs> sad, bro. Don't be thirsty yeah, for your neighbor's neighbor's planet. <laughs> yeah, man. Jeez. Stay out my planet. <laughs> I wish. The fuck. Okay, I'm. You know what? I'm digging. Uh, I can. I can see Dollar Ben's comment here. Selling and trading should be an intricate part of collecting as a collector. If not, you're just going to end up a single 54-year-old man. Well, you don't necessarily have to be single, but you'll end up an Damn. older man with a thousand comic boxes in your crib. No. Comic collecting, not comic hoarding. <clears throat> so yeah. It's a yeah. point of, you know, I do think there's something to the buying and selling part to, you know, refine. Like, as you get older, yeah, do you, I would kind of like the idea of, like, Refining my collection to yeah. certain shit, you know? right? Um, you don't have the room for all that stuff either. Sometimes, you know, yeah. So, so you know, I think there's something to that. Um, here's number twenty four. Damn, it's getting low. This one, if I'm not mistaken, I got dupes. Oh yeah, I do. Oh, we got dupes of twenty four. Nice. Bam. Oh, are we gonna was, dip between? Are we gonna dip between years. into the teens soon? Are we gonna dip into the teens? Oh, we, uh -oh. we gonna get into them teens, player. Good. <laughs> <That's laughs> Damn. Daredevil number twenty-three. Nice. Boom. <laughs> DD goes wild. Metarog says, "I only have forty boxes," <laughs> but. I know Metarog's not a big comic seller, but I know he does some trading, and I'm sure that's like the same idea of yeah, of course. Probably trade some books that his buddy wants to get some stuff that he wants. So yeah. I think it's the same idea. Yeah. D-Rung said, "Fuck that, he's just gonna hoard." <laughs> like, I don't want to hear shit about selling. <laughs> All right, <laughs> could be drowned in comics like Scrooge McDuck and shit. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, oh, he says, will we see a yellow suit? Oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Next up, number 22, the oh. Tri-Man. Deuce, deuce. Tri-Man. His tag team partner is the Bi-Man. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> He's very curious. They stand back to back. <laughs> the Bi and Tri. <laughs> Oh man. <laughs> uh next up we got number twenty, the verdict. Oh shit. With the owl. That shit's Kurt. That's fucking Kirby, bro. Right? No. This one's That's gotta be. That's I think not. Gene Cohen. We didn't get to the Kirby yet. Oh boy. Uh, <clears throat> or is it Wally? Cohen was good, man. Then we got dope. number what? 19, we getting into them teens. Oh, shit. 19, Daredevil. Taking on the underworld alone. Yeah. <laughs> Taking on the underworld in his underwear, brother. <laughs> <laughs> oh, baby, here we go. My favorite one of the bunch. The Kirby cover, dog. Number 18, feast your eyes on that. Oh. Is Kirby just knows how to do it. Let me full screen this fucking thing. Ew. Kirby knows how to do a color. Bang. What's that? that pose is so sick. Big body Kirby. That would be a dope uh, piece to have original art. Oh, yeah. That shit's fire. Oh, yeah, that's right. I forgot about... Uh, <clears throat> I forgot about the Ramita. Yeah, Ramita was in this run, too. Um, someone was saying First Gladiator. Which issue is that? Do I have First Gladiator? I really don't know. Like I said, I haven't had a chance to like go through the keys yet. I, I think that 
That one with the little tiny guy flying in there looked like a key to me, but I don't know. Okay, so we got 13. There's still some left. Let's see. 13. That's not free. Oh, wait. Sorry, I messed that up. This is 14. <laughs> We're going to go back up and then back down. <laughs> There's another 14. That's sweet, dude. Gladiator is 18. Did I have that? Oh, no. 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 See, that's the thing. I got some great books, but I know I noticed that keys were plucked from it. But I don't care, dude. When you're talking yeah. early silver daredevil, they don't have to be key. Yeah, dude. No, they really don't. no they're, they're already key being old like that. Fucking 12 cent cover. Come on, man. Yeah. Just to have that book is, you know, nice. And this is the last one I got. So that was number 13. That was the last one. And the last Come book. On, baby. Single digit. So oh, there shit. Go. Oh, that's good. Number nine. <laughs> Boom. Oh, <fuck>. Number nine. <laughs> Dude, that's nice, bro. I don't yeah, think I've man. seen that. That's really nice. I like it. That's cool. Yeah. That's like third red suit or some shit, too, man. That's pretty cool. Like second, yeah. what is it? Right, it's because seven. Yeah, seven's the first red suit. So I think you got the closer look at the condition. Nice. I need some fresh bags and stuff on it. But yeah, it ain't that bad for a white cover. It's like a little yeah, stain. That's a, that's a fucking score, dude. Yeah, man. Hell yeah. <clears throat> I like it. Yeah. And that he may see. Oh, that's funny you say that. Uh, dollar bin. The is that number four? First purple man? Because he had he had that one there, and he was trying to like. Get extra money for it. You should have got that bitch. And I turned it down because I was I was spinning, bro. I was spinning like a ceiling fan, dude. So I was like, I take that fucker. I need to go. I have a couple books on ice, including that one. I told him to put aside the the purple man. He's putting aside first appearance of the Black Widow for me. Nice. Ooh. For a just a screaming deal. Yeah, man. That's that little chunk. I mean, I can go for days. I know I need to, before I end the video, I definitely need to go through the Avengers run because it was talking to one of my homies and they were curious what Avengers one, uh, Avengers collector. I don't want to put them all, you know, he's an Avengers collector and he's like, yo, I'm trying to fill my run. I got a shit ton of Avengers. So I'm like, well, instead of sending you a oh, list. I, know. I think I know who it is. So I'll just do it on video, and you can just refer to that as to which ones I have. So if you guys don't mind. Well, show away. Show away. What's up, collectible paper? Your box is going out tomorrow. I got it sitting over there, packaged up, ready to go. Um. Yo, 84, I got people hit me up for their contents, dude. I have been having to tell them no, dude, left and right. I'm like, y'all got to chill with that shit. For their what? Content. They want to know what's in their box. Oh, <laughs> right, right. I've they're had at to, least two people, at least two people, close friends. Uh, trying to, they're trying to pay you off, Biggie? They like, get a little scratch? I, did, I didn't <laughs> I didn't hint or insinuate, dude. I was just like, can't say, dude. Can't let you know, bro. <laughs> Yeah, that's. I know I kind of set you guys up for that to be harassed, huh? I'm just letting you know, bro. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's cool. No, that's cool. They're, they're going to have it very soon. Yeah, yo, bro, within days. God damn, it's going to be so yeah. soon. Yeah. yeah, I like it this time around. Like last time there was a bit of a period between when people claimed them and when they actually shipped. But boom, some of them already en route to you. You've got your tracking numbers and... The rest are sitting right there. They're going to go out tomorrow. So it's going to be cool. cool. Um, what's someone else going to say? In response to somebody in here. Well, you guys pumped for uh, C2E2? It's coming up, man. Yeah, I'm pretty pumped. I'm. You know what part I'm not pumped about is like, I'm pumped about when I'm there hanging out. Right. I'm not pumped for all the fucking responsibility <laughs> of getting yeah. up. 
with the right timings. Got to catch a bus, get to the airport, right? Like, da da da, check into yeah. the. I'm not looking forward to all that shit. Yeah, I but, uh, I might be making a guest appearance at MegaCon. Hey, Ooh, what? Yeah, man. God damn, from Cali. <laughs> God damn, boy, you going cross country? No, 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 man, I'm in Jersey. <laughs> Oh, that's right. That's yeah. right. You're in Jersey. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that ain't that bad. Okay. Yeah, you're good. Yeah. You're golden. Yeah. Florida's not that bad. Right. I I, don't, I think my ticket will be fine. King Size Avengers uh, 6. King Size oh. Avengers. Nice. There's a couple bangers. In there. New clone. <laughs> There's new clone. King Size Avengers. I feel like maybe there's something key about this, but I don't know. Uh, King Size Avengers 2. I feel like I've seen them. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know either. I just know like two or three of them were. King Size Avengers 2. Now, for these, I guess I'm just going to... I'll start high. I think it's it's funner when I start high, right? And then go down. Yeah, man. All right. So let's go to these high ones. They're not all bagged and boarded. I mean, they're all bagged, but... 268... 266. 266 again. <laughs> 265. What the hell? <laughs> 265 again. Oh, the Beyonder. That's what that is. Yeah. Bukaki face. <laughs> 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 oh my god, again. <laughs> we got Damn. 262. Oh, I like that Hercules and Namor. Hell yeah. Two. There's some cool shit in that run, bro. Yeah. 261. I like Hercules. Hercules. I do too. If I can tell you, I'm, I'm thinking about doing a show. I'm going to do a show. Um, I don't know if it's going to be ongoing, but I go, I know I at least want to do one episode and I'm going to tell you it's going to be about spec and I'm going to give my fucking opinions on the spec game. <laughs> Yo, I'm going to get, I'm going to say I got some solid fucking spec uh, picks, but I'd be keeping under my hat dog. And I think they're right on. I'm a, I've already been winning. If you go back through my channel and the last I did a stream like a couple months ago and I said unboxing an MCU spec book. You go through my channel and you look up unboxing an MCU spec book uh, from a couple months back. I unboxed first Red Hulk. And everyone's talking about Red Hulk right now. First Red Hulk. Um, so let me tell you something, brother. I got my ear to the street. I already told you about Shuma Gorath. And you Dr. broke the vigilante. Yo, thank you, big. Thank you. Yeah, I remember I've been that. Preaching vigilante, I did it right on ninety show on my own channel. And what's up, vigilante Idris Elba playing him? I got multiple copies stacked still. I even sold a couple. So vigilante popped. So I'm just telling you, bro. Uh, yeah, see, Big Will knows Doctor Strange one seventy is a good spec. I think so too. That Shuma Gora, that one's just off my gut. Yeah. I've always said DC, Silver, and Kirby, by the way. So I'm I'm right, too. God damn it. <laughs> I'm right, too. Oh, my God. Look at this. Damn. Boom. 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 <laughs> Boom. <laughs> Jesus Christ. I'm happy for that. <laughs> Bro, how does the dude get five copies, bro? He must own a shop. Because I can tell by the backs that they're all the same. I bet you these three are the same. Ready? Sight unseen. Yep. <laughs> wow. No, oh, two of them are. Yeah, all three. Uh, no, they all are. So yeah. it's number 259. Jesus Christ. Uh, these two? Oh, <laughs> Fire Look at Bobby Books. Video. That's a dope cover, bro. Yeah. That's like his yeah. first appearance on it, Joe Most. Oh, look at that. Bigger. Oh, where to go? Yo, Hunt Champion, motherfucking Puff. Oh, yeah. Big Puff, dude. 
Craig six nine. He got a first vigilante in his round one eighty four box. Always wanted that book. Cardboard crazies. What's up? <laughs> Better rock multiple months. <laughs> yeah, I'm covered on multiple. Yeah, months shit. For a while. Yo, shout out to John. Him and Alex still got that hashtag Susan spec. Yep. You've been warned. All right, what number are we on? Are we pretty cover champion John? Yeah, cover champion John. That's right. Yeah. Two forty nine. Got the pitchforks out. Three eighteen. We yeah. jumped up. Like I said, I haven't really put these in order. But when we get lower, it's gonna get funner. Three fifty five. <laughs> we only have 400. And have, and yeah, there's a lot of Avengers. Uh, Mighty Avengers 244. Is that a different yeah, one? Man. I think that's a bunch of Busema, right? Mm. Busema did a bunch of Avengers, I thought. I could be wrong. Yeah, yeah, I think it is Busema. Yeah. 268. That's why I bought them. I was like, shit, this is some easy Busema shit to get. Two four six. Two forty two. Two forty six. All right, Metarod clarified. Yeah, the mighty Avengers is the same as just the original Avengers run. I kind of thought so because that number was pretty high for it to be a different run. Two forty five. That's cool. That the Captain Marvel mm-hmm. pick. Oh, I don't know. Yeah, I forget her name. Monica Rambo. Right. I I don't remember that one as it being a key. 244. What is creature? That one just keeps creeping up on us somehow. <laughs> oh, yeah, a <laughs> big monster. 243, vision with a little hat on. Okay. 242, we've seen that one already. Join the Elks Lodge. 238. Okay. A. Now let's get to the ones that were actually bagged and boarded. So I think those just by right are going to be better. Okay. So now let's get into these bagged and boarded mugs. 84 got rid of a pile of books for two days. And now he's got a big ass pile of books. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I got three boxes. I can't believe I bought three boxes of comics today. 236. That's pretty dope. Nice. 234. Hey. Yeah. 229. I love these. That's an egghead. That's Death of Egghead. I love that book. Oh, wow. Yeah. He dies in that. Semi racial character, weird character. Huh, that's a cool car. 216. Hey. Boom. Tigra. Nice Tigra. El Tigre, yeah. Where the fuck you say it? 213. El Tigre. Yellow jacket. Yellow jacket. Looking like a big old pussy. <laughs> no, he was a badass. Yellow jacket's like the <laughs> He looked like a pussy. Oh, yeah, he's a <laughs> <is> badass. <laughs> 212. That might be a key, dude. Shit's going down at the White House. Shit's going down, bro. I, there's a book that looks like that. That's key, I think. They got some oh. that have like them little Elf split queen. frames on the front that are key. It's pretty I cool. Forget the... Elf queen. Oh, if it's key, I got two of them. Okay. <laughs> Bang. <laughs> You're set. Uh, two. Two eleven. Oh. Bang. No, Chris. Nice. Yellow jackets here. <laughs> no, I actually had first yellow jacket, uh, Chris. I remember what that book is, but I ended Avengers. Up, honestly, because I'm not, I don't know, I'm not too much of an Avengers collector. 209. I'm trying to really stay in my lane on certain things. We'll see. 207. Oh, there you go. AKA, don't be surprised if there's an 84 auction soon. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 206. I don't think streets. these books are going to make it into the main 84 collection. Not a lot, not a lot of them. So, some of them will. But, oh, the next box is too crazy. Too crazy. 205. 
This is some good shit, though. I like these, yeah. like around two hundred and lower. I like that it runs, man. One ninety nine. Yeah, it is kind of cool. One ninety eight. There you go. <laughs> Metarock saying is one ninety six coming. Well, I can tell you with certainty that it's not because that copy that I had that I put in the eighty four box was. I plucked it out of this very run that I bought that I just bought today. Like I've been, oh. I already dug through his stuff. You know, oh. so I said like, cause how I said, yeah, some of the keys have been plucked out. Some of them were plucked out by me <laughs> <laughs> already. <laughs> but like I said, I was the deals we were talking. I was like, fuck it, bro. Just give me that whole box, dude. If that's what you want to do. One ninety three. Oh, I really like this one. I feel like I've seen this one around. 186. Uh, oh, that's some uh, John Byrne? I feel like this is John Byrne in this little run of uh, Avengers. Maybe Roger can clarify. Did, did Byrne handle Avengers duties right here? I just picked up a 196 myself. 90, okay. Yeah, uh, yeah, he did. Yeah, he did. I saw that. Why? I don't. I'm drawing a blank. Key plucker. Fuck is 196. Oh, first Taskmaster. Uh, oh, okay. Right. 185. Damn. And this is, dude. This is like 1979. This shit. Right. Yeah, you can tell, dude. Yeah. yeah. 79. Have a good night, Unruly Brother. It's a cool old book. Yeah, I think. Oh, no, Perez. I'm sorry, Perez. Oh, look at this. Look at the, the Absorbing Man. That's a fucking key. Man, the Absorbing Man. That's got something, that's it. It's got something to do with the Absorbing Man key. Maybe. I know it's not his first, but. It's something, dude. Oh, Metarock said, indeed, that was a burn issue. Nice. I don't think he had a run, huh? But that was burn issue. <laughs> 90. New book. New bangers. New price. The 84 box. Each <laughs> purchase comes with one clear still, too. <laughs> Shit. Okay, Carly's got some data. Avengers 186 is a key. Dealing with Scarlet Witch and Darkhold. Okay. The John Byrne issue, okay. Huh. I oh, think oh. it's probably to do with... You hear that? Yeah. Look what he says. Yeah. Also, Mo Dredd the yeah. Mystic makes an appearance. Remember that fucker from the last Yeah. Mo Dredd. Mo Dredd. Yeah. I was going to say I had to do something with her getting pregnant because in 200 she has that pregnancy shit, but I don't know. 174 with the collector. Gotcha. In the house. <clears throat> we just keep him tracking it on down, brother. 172 Holocaust in New York Harbor. Man. <clears throat> oh, nice. Yeah, that's the one that I have card. I don't know if you were here before when I showed that, but yeah, I got Marvel Chillers one. <clears throat> Hell yeah, you can get a fucking shout out, Eli Wilson. <laughs> Represent, brother, for the NWO. little NWO pop for Eli Wilson. <laughs> <laughs> what up, man? <laughs> yo. Yo, I'm Eli. <laughs> yo, yo. <laughs> what the fuck is going on in here? Shout me out, dog. <laughs> Wolf pack. Wolf pack. Uh, 1976, brother. Number uh, 157. Uh Dude, I don't know, once you once you hit that fifty cent mark, it's like you just like man. Yeah, how about when you get to that twenty five? Well, cent? yeah, that's you know. Yeah. This is it. That's a cool one. And they're all yeah. in really good shape too, man. Like yeah. I haven't seen a shitty fucking book yet. <laughs> oh, me right. neither. 
<laughs> I like torn. Bag done I'll bagged. Go. It didn't no oh. matter. They're all in good shape. <laughs> See that? Yeah. Just said that. And here's the most <laughs> beat one I've seen. Number 148. Look at this one. This one's pretty big. Uh, That's chunk. crazy, bro. That's the worst looking book of the lot. Right. Yeah. I know. I changed I changed my <laughs> fucking comment. Yeah. <laughs> 147. There's some beat up shit in that. <laughs> <laughs> For the most part, there's not. Oh, baby, look at this. One. How does this not have a board in it? Yeah, damn, it's still it's in nice shape. Look at this. One forty six, dude. Booyah, to down. Hey, that's a fucking nice one. That's a nice team cover, dude. Hell yeah. Yo, Terry, what up? TV, TV. Come. What, what? What was Kirby about, Meta Rock, brother? Did I fucking miss a Kirby? It must have been that beat up one. Oh, was there right. a that was passed? I bet it was the beat up one. Oh, maybe. Oh, maybe it's this one. Is this Kirby? I don't know, oh, dude. That's kind of quick, bro. We just looked at. It. You know what? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think that one's the one, dude. It'd be Kirby. It's got that Kirby bitch face. Oh no, this one. Look at that Thor and tell me that ain't Kirby. Yeah, the beat up one was my first suggestion. Yeah, that's yeah. fucking Kirby. That's look at those mitts. <laughs> Thor's mitt, bro. Damn. Kirby. Yeah, that's some Kirby digits. Yeah. Yeah. What up, Terry? And yo, Terry. I swear to God. He said 157. I keep on procrastinating a couple AOK -okay books that I got for Terry. But they're set aside for you, brother. They're coming, dog. Oh, these are nice. 133. Boom. Bang. The hooded one. Who's that? Bam. <laughs> How about so? What what was that number one thirty three? Why don't we cut that number in half, brother, and go to number sixty five? Oh, hey, sub one hundred. Look in the look at the condition, dude. Yeah, dude, look that's nice, that man. Dish. That is not yeah. too shabby. That is not shabby at all. But wait, there's more. Sixty one. <laughs> and yo, don't forget this. That blue mask outfit, Doctor Strange. Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, there he is. Yeah, man. Look at Black Knight like a fucking boss on his Pegasus. <laughs> I love that shit. That's a book that I'm hoping to come back from. Cats out the bag. I want oh, no. That's the one you're going for. Well, yeah, I want to see if I can find a good deal. On oh, it. you'll get that fucking book. I guarantee it. We'll see. <laughs> Uh, last but not least, the lowest number of Avengers in there, not in a bad condition. Number thirty, number Ooh. thirty. God damn, gentlemen, Avengers thirty. That's Kirby. That's absolutely Kirby. That's beautiful. I got a couple of Avenger Kirby's, bro. I fucking love them, dude. I gotta get some more, bro. You got it, Metarog. Yeah, there's a lot of these. I'll tell you guys when I when the definitive keepers. But yeah, man. I'm honestly I, I kinda get off on like just like kinda like with the eighty four boxes, like I like going and making some big score. Then I just bring it back to the community. Yeah. Yo, like, you know. <laughs> right. Let's, let's like a modern day Robin Robin Hood, right? Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Like let's work something out, you know. If you whatever, sell from the rich and give to the poor, dude. That's what I like. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, I I dropped an ass load of money uh, in the grand scheme. You know, I got a great deal, but uh, but my point is, what was that? <laughs> I'm gonna upcharge you. That's basically the point. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, I'm not giving it to you. You're only yeah, yeah, yeah. at least four times what I because there's shipping and you know yeah, that's the whole thing. My labor yeah. involved. Eighty four don't work for free, y'all. Yeah, gotta put it in a nice bag and board. So I got. Let's see. Which one is gonna be? Yo, theory dog. What up, homie? Let me go through these. 
And then what time is it? 830. Um, yeah, I'm actually going to bounce, guys. Yeah. All right, brother. All right, man. Later. We'll talk to you Later. soon. Later. Dude. NWO, bitches. NWO. It's been fun. We got... Because I got some... I got some low number... I got some low, low number Captain Marvels. And then I also got some low number Defenders. Hey. Which one you want to see first? Uh, I think I'll save the Marvels for last. Let's go with the Defenders. Okay. <clears throat> this one is just a one-off issue, so I'll just show it now. Warlock 6. Oh, yeah. Those are fucking nice. What up, Mike Rogers? Good to see you, dog. All right, we got votes for the defenders. Here we go. I never did finish my defenders run. I just got three and quit. Well, I did get a couple king size number ones. Let's start here. Oh, I think. I got number two, too. We got some Bill Sienkiewicz defenders. Number 135. Okay. This is that new Defenders team when it was like Iceman, Beast, um, Angel, if I'm not mistaken. A lot of X-Men characters I'm thinking about. The new Defenders. 129. Hell yeah. It goes way. The numbers go way down from here, trust me. One, oh, that's a cool color. 124. 103. Yeah, Sinkovich was a talented fucker, bro. He was, man. I'll be honest. He's he's hit and miss for me. There's some of it where I'm like, I'm not going to pretend this is good. It's kind of whack. But it's, be, it's because he's experimental as fuck. So some of it, sometimes it's not going to work. A lot of times it does, you know. But yeah, I'm okay with saying that I think some of his shit's not great. I, I haven't experienced a bunch of his shitty stuff yet, but it seems like he does a pretty good job to me. Like if you, I think he did a recent, like when that Fantastic Four number one reboot happened. Yeah. He did a run of variant covers, and he did like one character on each cover, like a Mr. Fantastic one, a Thing one, a Invisible Woman one. And I think they are the ugliest covers. <laughs> bro. People are like, oh, look, this is so hot. Bill, Bill Sienkiewicz. I'm like, those things are ugly. I think it's just because you like Bill Sienkiewicz. I, was, I don't know how you can look at those and think they're cool. Anyway, we're dropping down to the OG team under 100, number 93. Look at the condition on this. It's like the color is pop. It's clean. It's There's like barely any ticks on it. This is a high-grade issue of Defender. That's my boy, Subby, dude. Yeah, I'm really digging Submariner, man. He's a great character. 92. Yeah, that fucking tiger shark you got's gnarly. Mm. <coughs> yeah, I like that one. 91. Who's that? Valkyrie? Must be, huh? I think so. Uh, oh, another issue of 92. No, oh, put that in honor. Oh, let me put these away. Yeah, so these the early defenders get really good. Number 87. That's a weird team. Hulk, Hellcat, and Valkyrie. They'll get it done. I guess. Look, and it's, they have three heads in the thing. So it's definitely them. That must be it. 1980. Number 85. Nice hole. Nice. Number. Oh, shit. Look at this. Number 74. This Ooh. is bad. That's, that's giving me some kind of spider fucking tingle or some shit. It's weird. 
It might be something, dude. I don't know. It's weird the way he inked it. Like, there's no black ink on his body. It's like light blue and red. It looks strange. Right? You would think there'd be like yeah. ink on his muscles. Number 72. Nice. Number 48. What is the secret of Scorpio? Yeah. Goat says those books are very nicely preserved. I agree. They really are kept in nice shape, Goat. Oh, and by the way, Goat represent NWO. Um, oh, I'm spelling Kirby, brother. Uh oh, Defenders Kirby. Oh, look, this guy put a sticker on it, and he wrote Kirby cover. That's so funny. Oh, that's good. I always like those. Oh, I didn't even notice these key stickers. What? Look, look at this key sticker. Early Moon. Night. Oh shit! Early Moon Night. Nice. That's interesting. Oh yeah, look, he's in the background. I didn't even notice his ass. Look at Moon. Oh, what the fuck? Yeah. I got some early moon night, brother. In this one, Kirby cover. Look at this fantastic Kirby cover with the rhino blasting the Hulk. What? Crazy. Luke Cage back there mixing it up. There's a war on this shit. Damn. Oh, I like that. Bro, that. That Kirby rhino is funky. I know. <laughs> and what number is that? 42. We going way down still. I still got a little nice stack. 42. 41. Nice. 39. Yeah, them, them Defenders Hawks are dope, dude. Yeah. 34. Oh, wow. I know this team. These villains are from uh, She-Hulk. Sensational She-Hulk, number one. Metarog knows. This is, we reviewed it on the episode of Greater's Notes. Remember these three villains? From that episode of Greater's Notes with She-Hulk? <laughs> Weird-ass villains. There's a human head on an eight body, and then that chick with a red bulb on her head. Yeah. Very strange. Huh. Defenders 33. Shit. <laughs> no, I didn't loot a comic shop, but I looted a comic collector. It's Crib. <laughs> oh, this is fantastic. Defenders 32. Ooh. Great skull cover. I love that fucking hog, too, man. I don't know much about this Nighthawk guy. I don't think I've read much Nighthawk. It says it's his origin, so I might have to check that out to get a sense of who he is. Oh, we're going way down in numbers now. Because, yeah, because Defenders, Defenders, I think Silver Surfer. I think Silver Surfer, Submariner, Hulk. And here we go, number 11. Silver Surfer's on the squad. Yep. <clears throat> this is the squad right here. And this is, and I believe it, uh, Metarog talks about the excitement of when the Defenders were going to go toe-to-toe -to -toe against the Avengers. And he was like, yo, the Defenders were like less dudes, a smaller team, but they like were going to handle the Avengers because that is like one of the most powerful squads in all of comics. Hulk, Strange, Namor and Surfer is yeah. Murderer's Row of characters. Power. It's quite a team. Oh, Kyle Richmond Millionaire. The Nighthawk character. <clears throat> Here we go, baby. Oh, that's nice. I didn't even see this one yet. Defenders number nine. 
Ooh. There's a lot of those with Hulk kind of jumping at you. Yeah. Let's see. We still got a couple. I'm the fucking Hulk. It's Defenders. I better draw Hulk jumping, leaping in the air. Where? <laughs> Number eight. All right. Oh. Yeah, that's how they come in, bro. Strange and Surfer blasting. Look at that, bro. He's got the Madonna uh, cones. Well, yeah, cone titties going there. <laughs> 90 with a shit. New box, new price. <laughs> And then that could oh, the fingers, huh? He said, "Oh no, <laughs> sound like it landed flat." <laughs> yeah, it did. And no, I'm not really specking on defenders. I I don't think defenders will be in any kind of movie show. Type. Uh, you don't have to spec on them; they're fucking sold, dude. Everybody loves the shit, bro. Which is yeah. vintage shit. There's certain books that you know, if you want to be like a comic book investor, I would say, guess what? You're never gonna get a defenders movie or TV show. But buy nice condition, at least mid grade. Like get some mid grade defenders, mid grade, uh, you know, defenders and Avengers in your collection from the seventies, and it's a good investment. Even if nothing movie type shit happens, those are the kind no. of books that I think is going to go up in value. And I'm going to fucking that's part of my what I'm going to talk about in my spec video that I have planned. Of don't sleep on if you if you fancy yourself a little comic investor, it's not all about spec keys, bro. Just you get quality shit like this at Defenders Three. Guess what, bro? Give it a few years, it ain't going down in value. I'll tell you that. That's a good one, dude. <clears throat> yeah. Uh, let's see. Yeah. Silver so this, and gold. I'll do. I'll just run through the uh, the Captain Marvels with you, and then we'll bounce, um, and then I'll pick right. up. And that means that we'll still have half of a long box left, and a full. Excuse me, half of a long box left, and a full short box left. Uh, okay. So there'll be a part two. Plenty more goodies. Um, <laughs> Look at 90. I'm just always specking now. It's bad. Yeah, he's a spec addict. 90. He's a no good. 90, my, 90 misses this new comic book day show where you could fucking blast on people with his spec game. But Yeah. When so far, Biggie, you tell me. the <clears throat> So far, I don't know if he can even hear us because he said the audio is off. But so far on his on his whole show, his spec segment, so far the best spec pick in all his episodes that panned out, it's from your boy. When I mentioned, I was like, can I give you a contribute? <laughs> so far, the best spec segment has been from your guest host, 84, dude. That's all I'm saying. Yeah, I don't, I don't know. Well, I'm a big fan of 90s new comic book day show. Me too. And... I think that he does. I think my favorite spec he does is Thor spec. So I think that yours was really good and you pulled a fucking Magellan because you weren't even, you guys weren't even going to do it for a second. And you, it was like, he gave you crap for it. So it's, it's pretty much tied up. Like that was big, bro. I don't, you know what? You did kind of create one out of nothing. Like people have already heard of Thor. No one ever heard of fucking Vigilante. So I'll give you credit, bro. Right here. <laughs> All right, we're gonna go through Captain Marvel's the Captain Marvel run to round out the show, ladies and gentlemen. We're gonna start with Captain Marvel number fifty-eight. These are in nice condition. <laughs> yeah, Roger's saying, did you say Magellan? I did something like a Magellan. <laughs> you, call, you call me Magellan of the, of the comic game? I don't know what I'd say half the time. Just explore a new territory, dude. Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm saying. That was a pretty good fucking. I'm a genius, bro. Yeah, like, that's not a bad analogy. Like, no, it's not. It's really. It's almost fucking better than. Yeah. Anything. I like it. Fifty six. 
55. The nice. dude named Death Grip. He's got a death grip on his wrist. <laughs> yeah, D. And I'm only halfway through everything, but I'm just going to do this last chunk and then I'm going to jump off. I got to eat dinner too. Uh, number 54. <clears throat> yeah, I know. I've I've heard a uh, Kachun. I could I know Kachun is a big uh, Marvel fan. <laughs> Dora eighty four the Explorer. <laughs> that's right. Fifty three. That's fantastic. Wow, that's interesting. Fifty one. Nice. Forty nine. Rounding the accuser. Him up. Rounding the accuser. That's right. Before you accuse me, take a look at yourself. In the words of Eric Clapton. Number forty eight. Hey, let's see. You think we're gonna go down into the the green costume? We'll see. I hope so. Forty seven. Oh, how did this sneak in there? I didn't even know this was in there. Look, so forty seven. Is that a duplicate? Yeah, duplicate of forty seven. And on the back, we got an X Men one seventy six. Oh, and it's signed. No, no, that's just oh. one of those covers where he's like destroying. Oh, fuck. Okay, okay. I can see why you say that, though. Oh, hold up. Okay, first appearance of Cheetah, this guy. Oh, dope. <laughs> 46. Another issue of 46. <clears throat> 43 is Drax, the Destroyer. Yeah. Looks a lot different than the comics. OG Drax. 41. Rick Jones. 41. 40. Thirty-six. That's the watcher. Look at the watcher. Looks crazy on that. Yeah, that's a big watcher. Yeah, he's all buff. Oh, we got I guess another. they come in different sizes. Yeah, you're right. All these books are begging for some mylar magic upgrades. You're right. Twenty-four. Okay. Now we're getting into the primo silver age. Yeah. Glory goodness. Yeah, we're getting close to that green suit too. 23. <clears throat> Here we go. So 23. I actually plucked a uh, a chunk out of these before. So, and it was from that that range cuz I remember I grabbed the the issue that he like first got the suit. Anyway, number 12. Ooh. Damn, that's nice. Yeah. Hmm. That's right, Big Will. Here's your frame cover. Number 11. There's some great colors on this. Number, oh, man. What a, what a striking fuck cover. Number nine. Ooh. Man, is this Starling? I really like that. <clears throat> number Ocho, number eight. 
Damn. Pretty cool. Number seven. Huh. The coming of Quasimodo. That's some fly shit, bro. I wonder who did that. Yeah, I'm not sure. Number six. Oh, number eight was key. Number eight in the first appearance of CyberX. What the heck? Was there a book on the back of that? Oh, how can he keep missing these books? Oh, that's why. I put it in the wrong slot. Hold on. I was like, what's all these Avengers books in Oh, so this is Gene Colan, too. Yeah, Gene Colan's a, a beast, man. He did these Captain Marvels, did some of those Daredevils. Yeah. He did one of my favorite Submariner Iron Man 1 covers, dude. Oh, that's him? Yeah, that's Gene Colan. Yep. And then the last one of the Captain Marvels, issue two, man. Issue number two. Damn. I got number three. It looks nothing like that. That's crazy. It's probably Colin, bro. Yo, I got a dip 84, bro. It's been a blast, man. Hell yeah. Good to see you, dog. Um, yep. I got a talk to, but. Uh, I'll wrap up here while you, you know, if you got a bounce. All right. Catch y'all later, dude. NWO for life. Too sweet. Um, Yeah, so there you have it, guys. We went through a lot of fire. Not least of which was some of these early Daredevils. Daredevil single digit number nine and Kirby. Kirby Daredevil. I'm going to... I'm going to get, you know, all these books in nice bags and boards. I don't know if I'm going to my light everything. That's going to get expensive. But maybe some of them. Some of these daredevils I might. Uh, but at least I'm going to get some nice Silver Age bag and boards. Give these guys a nice home. Because sometimes the, look, the book looks worse. Because, and it's not Mylar magic. It's just the fact that. The bag is so wavy. It's like that's not really an imp a re accurate representation of how smooth the cover is, you know? So it kind of makes the book almost look like it's wrinkly or water damaged when really it's fine. It's just the bag. So I'm going to get some, some new bags and boards on there. Um, we had uh, that first gambit. That was a fun one. And you know what I'm going to do? Since the issues that I've shown thus far was only halfway through this long box, I'm going to do a random pull before I leave on the big chunk of the box that um, I haven't gone through yet that I'm going to go through next episode. And the book that I pull, because I know it's a big long run, is going to give you a little sample of, because as you can see, we got a lot of Bronze Age, early Bronze Age. Um, wait, not early, because Silver ends. Either way, Bronze Age, late Silver, Marvel type stuff. A lot of runs. So I'm going to do a random pull towards the back side of this box to give you an idea of what's going to come next. And let's random pull... this okay so stay tuned till next time where we're probably gonna dig real deep and explore a beautiful 1970s run of the mighty Thor there's gonna be lots and lots of books you know of all the as you've seen I've gone through some runs the Thor section is the biggest chunk. I think there's probably like 50, between 50 and 60 issues of Thor, all from this era. So, um, 
we'll have that to look forward to for next time. Thank you, everybody, for hanging out. Have a good night. Yeah, I know. It's, it's crazy how uh, almost two hours. I'm hitting my capacity. Time for me to go. Have a good night, guys. Adios. See you next time. Oh,